What condition are the lads in after the test against Bath at the weekend? Um, sort of, you know, 48 hours, 72 hours later, which is about where we are now. Uh, pretty happy with the state that the boys are in. Um, Monday is a big day where we, is essentially our preparation day for the week. Um, and uh, the first sort of three, four hours of the day, they're a little bit slow to get going. Um, but we put certain protocols in place and certain exercises and sessions in place to help maximise today, which is their sort of, you know, intense rugby day. Um, and uh, yesterday was a success. The boys trained really well the latter half of the day and uh, has fully prepped them for uh, a big day today. Generally, since pre-season training began, are you happy with the, the physical size and strength of the squad? Uh, yes, I am. Um, it's still um, a considerable sort of part of our pre-season strength programme to go. Um, albeit that now we're pretty much into an in-season uh, rugby programme. Um, demands on placing on the guys are quite high. Um, but so far, yeah, in terms of uh, guys that we needed to get bigger, guys that we need to get a bit trimmer, shall we say, and a bit fitter, um, so far we're all sort of on the right path. And um, obviously last Saturday's fixture was a nice little uh, benchmark test to see where it sort of compares to the, uh, to the boys at the top. And is there a good amount of rivalry here in the gym when it comes to who's the strongest, who's the quickest? Yes, there is. Um, we like to each sort of um, end week of our certain blocks that we go through. Um, we have, in terms of our strength program, we do a, a sort of what's called a repetition maximum test. So they begin for as many repetitions as possible on certain key lift exercises. And yeah, positionally um, on the board behind you, you might see as well, there's some sort of numbers and initials next to them. So the boys are always trying out people. And that just puts a good competitive spirit in the gym and makes it a good, uh, good bit of competition. And boys will always push themselves harder when, when that's on the line. So uh, yeah, it's pretty successful. Obviously, a lot of new faces here at St Peter's this year. Have the new players brought their own ideas and perhaps a new level of fitness discipline? Well, I think um, not so much that. I just think each year, certainly the, this is my third pre-season here, um, and as the club has evolved in its sort of age of professionalism, each year across the board, um, we're getting... Uh, uh, more breadth of sort of players who have come from either professional backgrounds or have been in professional backgrounds and, and sort of on the way up. So each year the kind of the level of athlete across the board has improved um, and that just means for uh, a, a better training environment and everyone, like I say, pushing themselves a little bit more than they thought they were previously capable of. So yeah.